Welcome to the second episode of Grid Life Gold for January 2018, where I take you through the month's Games with Gold lineup to see whether or not they are worth your time and hard drive space in the shortest amount of time possible. I will be focusing on all games brought to the Xbox 360 and Xbox One. This series will have two videos per month for each wave of Games with Gold. First on the list is Zombie U. I mean, Zombie, developed by Ubisoft. The former Wii U exclusive is a first-person survival horror game. Survival horror is one of my favorite genres, so I was absolutely tickled to play it. It felt great to roam the dark, musky streets of zombie-ridden post-apocalyptic London. It felt even better to cave in zombies' faces with a cricket bat, which is used plentiful. The guns weren't satisfying enough, so I kept slugging away. Lots of scanning was involved in this game. It would have been more novel on Nintendo's dead console but not so much on the Xbox. Overall though, Zombie is a good survival horror game, lacking a little much needed polish. The 21 and a half gigs required is a little too much, but I'd say give it a shot if you like games like Resident Evil 7 and Outlast. Next off is a dude bro shooter developed by EA Montreal that came out nearly 10 years ago. Maybe it's my fault for not playing this game a decade ago, but this game didn't appeal to me much. First of all, the shooter starts out with a tutorial that lasts way too long. Come on EA, I just want to shoot people with real bullets instead of rubber bullets. The gameplay is Gears of War done on a budget. I had to slightly press Y to duck into cover or else I'd jump over whatever object it was. It was hella annoying. The red bar on top of the HUD felt super unnecessary. No duh, I'm gonna be attacked more if I'm the more aggressive player. The graphics are super bland and uninteresting. Oh wow, another shade of brown! The ridiculous handshakes and cringeworthy dialogue made the Xbox power button more inviting by the second. The only redeeming quality of this game was the back-to-back -back firefights. But alas, that wasn't enough to sway my opinion over this shit show. Army of Two, more like Army of Poo. The 5 gigs aren't worth your precious hard drive space. Well, this was a half-assed wave of games with gold to round out the month of January 2018. I'm hoping we'll get a better selection for the first wave of February. Until then, this has been Mike and Benfit, and I will most likely be back for episode 3 because no one else wants to make it. Follow us on at GridLifeDigest on Twitter, at GridLifeDigestPod on Facebook and Instagram so you never miss what's happening. Stay tuned for new episodes of our podcast airing every Wednesday.